They found, I guess, her dream dog online. They bought it. It was a whole scam. Who Wait. paid for the dog? Because who paid what? What? You don't think? Because it sounds like a damn scam. Who set? And I'm not accusing this man of this. Who the hell has time to make up a whole website? If you're not a scammer, with fake pictures of dogs. I mean, there's like probably like 50 dogs on this website, if yeah. not more. It's like what the? Like this man has a whole business he runs. Um. He's not sitting around trying to make up fake websites. He doesn't have that much time on his hands. But unlike some other people on the show, they actually have a lot of time on their hands because they want to go do digging. Girls, I have a whole file that I made, and I'm going to drop it off to you, but it's about Jennifer and the puppy situation. No. I started to investigate her boyfriend. And try and have a whole file on you. Yeah. And my I mean, I think I, I spoke a little bit. I it's gonna be that's broke bitch behavior. It's 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 to a point now where it's it's like it's like you you hear it, you receive it, and then you kinda just it's like you just have to like she is miserable. And I like had I've had like it's like when you think about this person, it's like you, you you started with Evelyn, you start fishing around with whatever Evelyn had going on, which you had nothing to do with, and then you're moving on to the next. So tell them who your next victim is, right? This, and I feel sorry for that person, whomever it may be, but honestly, it is broke behavior because honestly, me and Jen, we wake up and we do whatever the fuck we want to do, and my day is done by 11 a.m right um the bag is already secured by 11 a.m every single morning so um making fake websites for 750 dollars listen it's, it's 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 just crazy to me right why would christian want to scam jennifer out of the dog did he set up the website for jennifer to pay and then he takes the money vanessa here you go again friend is somebody else's relationship and somebody else's business jackie and vanessa were, I guess, cooking for their husbands and having like a, a, a dinner date. And neither one of them know how to fucking cook. So the goddamn potatoes weren't even, I don't even know. I think like, it was that decor. You guys, Vanessa put her love into the, the potatoes cook. Are those raw potatoes? Raw potatoes? Listen, hold on for a second. I'm proud of you. Like, uh, I think the potato is supposed to be the core that goes around the chicken. I think that was it. Was that a chicken or a hen? I don't know what the hell it was. Whatever it was, this shit looked nasty. What, uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to eat the potato, and if the potato ain't right, I'm just going to drink wine. Do it. <laughs> <laughs> like, bitch, you should investigate how to make some goddamn rice, because you couldn't even do that. I use the cheese out of this to put it on the rice. Okay. Oh, so wait, you you do it like this and put it in a microwave? Mm -hmm. That ain't how you do it. You're supposed to cook them separate one minute in the microwave. So there's a whole bunch of other things that you could investigate besides my man, my man, my man. Okay? Like, you just... That's when it started. Right? It started with her trying to calculate you know, your kid's age. And then remember at Giselle's event, how he told us he had two kids? They're little. Girl, he got a whole 13-year-old. And then it was like, oh, well, you know, I did some digging. And, you know, he has a 13-year-old a son, and he went to prison for 10 years. It's like, girl. I don't know if she knows any of this information, oh but God. he did 10 years in prison. No, he didn't. No, he didn't stop. Not well, I would want someone to tell me maybe she don't know. Maybe she does know. Our first date, I told Jennifer that I went to prison. I told her that I had children. I told her that all my mistakes that I've made up until, you know, at that point, right? So all of the, the foul that you're digging up, Vanessa, number one is public record. Okay, so anyone can look it up. You sure this is the right Christian? Yes, but he changed his name. He's living under- He changed his name. Mm -mm. Right? Yes, I did change my last name for generational purposes, right? Because I wanted to break the curse and I wanted to be that pillar for my children, right? And I wanted to create my own lane, which I already had a conversation with my father for uh, about 
hey, I'm changing my last name to Gold. I'm keeping my first name because I love my first name. My name is Christian. Yes, my last name is Gold. Cool. People change their names all the time. Doesn't mean I'm running from anything. I really missed my calling. I should have been a CIA agent, but I started getting arrested too early, like 17, 18. So then I just, you know, went in a different direction. But if you have any problems, I'm your girl. You are over there pointing fingers when you yourself have been arrested multiple times and you've been arrested for for things. And, and you have been in jail. So it's like... Um, girl, you, you acting like, you know, you, you a step for a wife or something like <laughs> get out of here. And my thing is, here's the thing. Even if Christian was the worst person in the world, it's none of your business. A little concerned about certain things. And apparently so is Vanessa because she's investigating him. Now girl, she all, can't have this much time ways. on her hands, bro. Even if Christian is on some shady <laughs> or scamming, Jennifer is grown and Vanessa needs to stay out of it. That is the point that we are missing. It's not your business. Why do she keep being in people's business? She was in Evelyn's business. Now she's in Jen's relationship business. It's not her business. Jen's gonna tear her ass up. One, bitch, I don't even know you. Like, you're not my friend. Yeah, she she raised, <laughs> she said she was concerned about... You're not concerned. Yeah. You are just a nosy, broke bitch. Like, that is broke bitch behavior. Who the fuck has time to do that? Like, bitch, go get a job with the FBI if you got all that time on your hands to be doing that. I mean, you can't because you're a convict too, I think, right? So it's like, you hypocritical shit and behavior is just crazy to me, right?